Hello everyone and welcome to the Civil Engineer channel. In this video, we will discuss the basics of lean concrete, its purpose and use in construction projects and we will also discuss the advantages and disadvantages of lean concrete. Lean concrete is a crucial material used in the construction industry and understanding its purpose and properties is essential for anyone involved in construction projects. Whether you are new to the field or looking to refresh your knowledge, this video will provide you with valuable insights into the topic. So let's dive in and learn more about lean concrete. First of all, we will discuss what is lean concrete. Lean concrete is a type of concrete made by mixing cement, sand and water with a low quantity of cement. Concrete with a high ratio of aggregate to cement is called lean concrete. It has a lower cement content and higher water cement ratio than regular concrete. This concrete has a lower cement quantity than amount of liquid paste present in it. In simple words, you can say that this is not a rich concrete. Or you can say that the amount of cement is less as compared to the other concrete. As we have discussed that the liquid paste is more in this concrete. So, so the consistency or workability of lean concrete is more than regular concrete. Which makes it easy to pour and spread. Now we will discuss the purposes or uses of lean concrete. The main purpose or use of lean concrete is to provide a strong and stable base or foundation for a construction project. It is commonly used as a sub base layer for roads, pavements and floors and as a base for different types of flooring systems. Lean concrete is also used to create a solid base for the construction of walls and columns. Lean concrete is also used for leveling purposes. It is used to level a surface and to provide a platform for construction of foundation for walls and columns. Now we will discuss the advantages of lean concrete. The first advantage of lean concrete is that it is cost effective or economical. Lean concrete is more cost effective than regular concrete as it requires less amount of cement. As we know that the most expensive material in concrete is cement and the quantity of cement in lean concrete is less as compared to the ordinary concrete so it is cost effective or economical. As we have discussed that lean concrete has less amount of cement which make it porous and permeable which enable lean concrete to have good drainage properties which make it ideal for sub base layer where drainage is necessary. Easy to place and compare. The fluid consistency of lean concrete make it easy to pour and spread and it can be easily compacted using simple tool. It is also good for the environment because less amount of cement is used in lean concrete make it more sustainable option as it reduce carbon emission during the production of cement. Now we will discuss some of the disadvantages of lean concrete. The first disadvantage is low strength. Lean concrete has lower compressive strength than regular concrete which makes it unsuitable for load bearing structure. You cannot use lean concrete to construct load bearing walls, columns or other load bearing structures. It is also not suitable for harsh environment. Lean concrete is not suitable for harsh environment as it can cracks or degrade over time. The third disadvantage of lean concrete is its limited use. Lean concrete is limited in its use and is only suitable for specific application such as sub base layer, base power flooring system and base power walls and columns foundation. But you cannot use it for a structural member like column foundation and slabs. The conclusion of the video is lean concrete is an essential material used in construction projects. Its purpose is to provide a strong and stable base for the construction of road pavements, floors, walls and columns. It is cost effective, has good drainage 
properties and it is easy to place and compact however it has some limitation in terms of strength and durability and it is not suitable for load bearing structure or harsh environments it's all for today thank you for watching our video on lean concrete and the purpose of lean concrete i hope you found this video lecture informative and useful if you have any question or comments please leave them below in the comment section if you have liked this video please give it a thumbs up and hit the like button your support help us create more quality content like this if you have not already please consider subscribing to our channel for more videos on civil engineering construction and related topics by subscribing you will be notified when a new video is uploaded thank you again for watching and we hope to see you in our next video